second down. Manning's going to be in the pistol here. Play fake. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Incomplete. The hit jarred the ball loose. Does it take talent to do something like this? You've got to time the pass where the football is going, where the receiver is going to catch it and do the perfect timing. Hit that receiver, and that football comes flying out. Nice job that time. Incomplete pass. Following that incompletion, it sets up third and ten. Manning's lining up in the pistol. Here's the handoff. Off the left side. The tackle is made, and that's a three-and-out series for the offense. That timeout might be very useful for the offense. They're now ready to go. They're going to go for it here on fourth and seven. Peyton Manning under center. The Broncos snap it at the 36. They run the counter play. Williams in on the tackle. You see the matchup in running back, and while only one side has really been able to count on that run game, it's still a very close game. Yeah, it is, Jim. Close game here, and also that can happen when you talk about run games. They're going to go up and down, and if you're having trouble running the football, then change the direction of your offense. Do something else. One last play before the quarter ends. First down at the 34. McCoy's handed the football. They'll mark him at the 34. One quarter to go, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The Bills are still in possession as we get this final quarter underway. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. We're drawing near a close, and the defense is trying to preserve a victory. Here is the first snap of the final quarter. Manuel's unable to find his target that time. Trailing every third down so big at this point. Third and nine. Throws the pass. And off the mark on that short throw. They'll go for it on fourth down. Late stages. Manuel's got everybody split out wide. Out of the shotgun. And there's Clay. Has 12 on this play. That'll stop the clock with that timeout. So we go back to the field, out of the timeout. The offense is out there now with no timeouts. What do you see them doing here with so little time left? Well, it's what you've worked on for so many weeks, no doubt about it. you got to know when to get out of bounds. If that opportunity arises, do it. If you are tackled inbounds, get up, line up, so you can either spike the ball or get the next play off. First down. Let's see what they come up with here. Coming to the line. Hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Good defense to deflect the pass and force the incompletion. Good job by the linebacker that time. Saw the receiver coming in his area. Read the quarterback and in wonderful position to knock the pass down. Second down late in the fourth quarter. 
McCoy lines up in the backfield. Second and ten. Going for the deep ball. He brings it in. Ward that time in on the tackle. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing. But you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. Play number six coming up on this drive. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Here's the give to Fred Jackson. Running to his right. Jackson's tackled down after a gain of five. Well, that last play almost got him in here. And when you look at this, what do they do? Well, you just want to punch it in. There's a lot of, a lot of different scenarios. You could do a play-action fake, probably get somebody wide open, or have a running back just jump over the top for the touchdown. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Second and goal from the two-yard line. And he's thrown to the ground. Bill, it's third down. They are in four-down territory, and the defense knows that. Yeah, and you get in a situation like this, Jim, on the defensive side, you need one of your pass rushers to come through and get on that quarterback. Offense lines up here. Third and goal from the seventh. McCoy is going to secure the handoff. It's fourth down coming up, and of course, they are going to go for it here. You have no doubt they're going to go for it here on fourth down. What does the defense do? Do they play a conservative, or do they take a chance and really go after the offense to stop this fourth down play? Kick the field goal now. They're going to go for it instead. Huge play coming up. Offense looking for one more play to make. McCoy's called on once again. And he will not score. But the, the Denver Broncos have won the Super Bowl. The Lombardi Trophy heading back to Denver. Super Bowl champions. An unbelievable year ending with a great Super Bowl victory. How do you handle the pressure? They handled it well, and handling that pressure was the difference. That's why they won the game. with a Super Bowl victory. Truly a special moment. For Phil Sims and all the crew, I'm Jim Nance. Stay tuned for the post-game wrap-up show, and we'll see you next year here on EA Sports.